Hi, I'm Ron Smith, NDSU Extension Horticulturist. And tree wrapping in the fall is a good idea on tender bark trees, and this would usually be include young apple trees, uh, pear trees, uh, plum trees, cherry trees, things like that. Any young tree would benefit from being wrapped. Wrapping does not keep the tree warm. At what it does, it does two things. Actually, it protects the tree from sun scald. It also protects the tree from the, uh, the rodents uh, chewing on the, uh, on the bark, actually girdling the bark and killing the tree. And that would take care of your rabbits. That would include your rabbits and your voles. So it's a good idea to, um, to wrap the trees. There's several products on the market. I have a tendency to uh, like the, uh, the, uh, what's called craft paper, which is a stretchable paper sent with um, uh, a sandwich of, of uh, some tar in between it so it gives it a protection there and uh, it seems to do a pretty good job of keeping the bunnies out and it's fairly easy to go ahead and employ. Here's an example of some old sun scald and you can see that the tree has done a pretty good job of healing itself and it's gotten a tougher bark over the years and so it's going to come through this okay we hope. A couple of years ago if they had wrapped this tree uh, we wouldn't have had the sun scald showing up uh, like you see right here. The sun does not scald the bark of the tree but what happens actually on the south and the west sides of the tree on tender bark trees is that the sun on a clear winter day with snow all around it reflecting the light back can have that bark temperature get up to what's called physiologically active temperatures where you're going to have the cell tissue there starting to uh, transpire, uh, get into some kind of physiological activity of considered quote unquote plant growth, become tender and then the sun goes down or goes behind the cloud and the air temperature is at say 10 degrees or below zero suddenly that, that bark is subjected to that very, very cold air and you get this fissuring or splitting of that bark tissue and that's what's called sun scald. So this wrapping, a protective uh, a layer around that tree will help to, to control that sun scald from ever developing. And what we want to do is we want to start on the bottom and wrap our way up to the top. You want to get yourself as close to the base of the tree as you possibly can or reasonably can. Reasonably tight because it's stretchable material. And make sure you overlap. One year when we did this, we had a young apple tree, just a little whip of an apple tree, and we wrapped it. And we got it up to the first branching. And we had so much snow that year that the snow came right up to the first branches. <laughs> OK? The rabbits walked across the top of the snow and ate the branches right back to the snow line, which, which is where the tree wrap was. <laughs> And so I was all set to take the tree out, and my wife says, no, 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 wait, let's just wait, see what happens here. And so uh, the tree came out from that point and, and uh, did a good job. Okay, now we've gone up as far as we need to, and then we can take and cut this and then tape it up here just to help, us, help us secure it. Any young tree would benefit from being wrapped.